Hey guys, in today's video, actually it's a kind of a dangerous situation video, but before I get into that, I want to talk about free to grow for just a second. They basically answer my phones. It's an AI software that answers the phone, books an appointment, gets their address, phone number, information, and does that all without me having to do anything. Before them, I was either answering the phone myself and putting it in my calendar or I was letting it go to voicemail. Like when I'm busy, I just let it go to voicemail, which means I missed several calls. On a busy day, if they didn't leave a message at voicemail, I didn't call them back. Now with Free to Grow, all those calls are being answered and it sounds just like a real human talking to them. They make an appointment or if they don't like talking to an AI software, they send you a text with a recording and you can call them back. I mean, it's just freed up my time and made my day much simpler. I do work by myself, so this seems like it was designed just for me or for small businesses like me. So it works out, it's a good software for me. In the video I have for you today, this is the reason that gas companies around here will not turn on the gas unless somebody like me or a licensed plumber is there to supervise or check everything. It's a liability problem and it's a liability because of what you're about to see in this video. Stay tuned. Hey guys, I'm at a commercial location that is being renovated and I want to show you something that the gas man and I, the utility man and I found when we tried to turn on the gas. Watch this. See if y'all can hear it. All right, y'all should have been able to hear that and see those needles moving. That should not happen. That means we have a major leak inside and I think I have found it. Stay tuned. All right, I found this in here with the hot water heater and I think that's gonna be our problem. as tight as I need to get it all right I don't know what that goes to but um let's see if that fixed our gas leak all right let's try this again nope that was not it Hmm. You know it's another hot water heater in the back, right? Yeah, that little one that's up on the shelf. All right, let's take a walk around in there. Let's see if we can't find something else. All right, I'm gonna try to. <clears throat> Turn that off. I think there's another one over here. Let's see if that stops my leak. Of course, I'm not seeing anything right here. I didn't see anything else inside. I don't know where that gas is going. Lovely. 
All right, now guys, I'm looking for new floors. Anywhere. New floors? Yeah, new floors in case um somebody has cut off something on the floor. Where's that? Right here? I don't know. I still didn't see anything. I got that fellow that was helping me walk around. He's in there listening to one spot. Okay, this one has a gas line too. It was once a gas pack. Everything seems intact, but I think I've decided to get a gas company out here to find that gas leak. This one is a heat pump, so I'm going to focus on that one. I'm afraid, afraid to leave that gas home for too long. And this one is not running. Let's see if we got power. Nope. Nope. I just checked all the breakers. Oh. <laughs> Lovely. Looks like somebody's already been digging around that. I got no power. I just checked all the breakers, I don't know. Mm. I don't know if y'all could see that, but I, I just checked power in here. Let's see if I got any power. Nothing. I'm trying to think if I got the stuff on my van to um, disconnect the gas line and pressurize with something else like nitrogen or air. I'm not sure I have that with me.
I do hope you enjoyed that video. I kind of enjoy making them. That job was referred to a gas company. I do have the ability to take care of something like that, but I think it's gonna require crawling in the attic and maybe two people. So um, I did refer it to another company and I'll go back when it's fixed, try to get their gas turned on. Um, the electrical problem for the heat pump was fixed and that one is running but we're working on the gas on this one. So I'll be back on that one in a couple of days. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, how about like and subscribe and I'll catch you on the next one.